CCTV pictures have emerged showing three UK school girls on the Turkish leg of what is believed to have been their journey to join Islamic State in Syria. Shamima Beatham and Amira Abbas, 15, and Kadiza Sultana, 16, flew from London to Istanbul on February 17. The images show them waiting at Bayram Pasa bus station later that day. Scotland Yard believes the Bethnal Green Academy students are now in Syria. They are thought to have been met at the border by its militants. The BBC understands that the girls waited in the offices of two bus companies at the station, before taking the bus to Orfa, close to the Syrian border, on February 18. From there, they are thought to have been driven to a border crossing point by people smugglers. Time codes on the CCTV images suggest the girls were at the bus station, which is on the European side of Istanbul, for nearly 18 hours. The five images were taken between 2027 local time 1827 GMT on February 17 and 1322 1122 GMT on February 18. They had flown from Gatwick to Turkey after telling their parents they were going out for the day. The girls' families have made a number of emotional appeals for them to return home. Picked up in cars but sources have suggested the three girls, all described as straight-A students at their East London Academy entered Syria near the Keyleys border crossing five or six days ago. BBC correspondent James Retnaut Singazi Antek, South East Turkey, has been told by a man claiming to be a people smuggler that the girls were driven to the Syrian border. The man, who called himself Arli Kathem, said the teenagers then walked a few steps into Syria. The group of waiting is men immediately picked them up with cars he said. Turkey's Deputy Prime Minister Bülent has said officials would have taken necessary measures to intercept the girls had they known about them earlier. Scotland Yard has denied taking three days to inform officials in Turkey about the girls' planned journey. It said it had started working with Turkish authorities a day after the girls went missing. They had been studying for their GCSEs. The fourth girl from the school is believed to have traveled to Syria in December. The school has denied the girls could have been radicalized there.